Okay guys, just wanted to show you what I'm doing now. Um, I was talking about doing the hydroponics this year with my garden, the uh, Dutch buckets. Um, and um, got quite a collection of uh, free buckets from the grocery stores and the bakery departments. They're throwing away their icing buckets. So I um, took the advice of some other YouTubers and um, went up and picked some of these out. Um, I was going to show you the buckets here in a second. You know, I'm going to start cleaning them out now. I got my fertilizer in just a minute ago from Morgan County Seeds. Um, 41838 Master Blend and the Calcium Nitrate 1500. Of course, you also have to mix Epsom salt with this. Um, but I'm real excited about that. Real excited about getting this going. So now I uh, have to start cleaning out these buckets and um, you know, getting going from there. Uh, I've already got some tomato seedlings coming on, and um, but this ultimately is the first step, and try to get this over with. Let's show you the buckets here in a second. Um, what they look like. Got 22 buckets here. I managed to get from the stores, uh, all for free. Um, over here on the end, I got a five-gallon bucket. And I've got three four gallon buckets and I got three three and a half gallon now, to me they pretty much look identical but these are actually three and a half all the rest of these here 13 stacked up are two gallon buckets and then they're on the end were just these tiny ones I got on one haul that you know I may just use those for chicken feed or something they're kind of too small I think really one of them's actually clear one's white plastic so um my plan is I don't know about the five gallon. I may still grow a tomato in that one, but if not, I've got six buckets for tomatoes. I always have to say I got six or seven buckets for tomatoes. I still may grow a few in these small ones, but these small ones I think I'm gonna the two gallon ones. I'm gonna grow uh, some bell peppers, uh, cayenne peppers, and maybe a few cucumbers here and there, and um, see how that works out. And um, just gonna show you this too real quick. I got my uh, fertilizer in. I got my free catalog from Morgan County Seeds. I ordered it from their website. Uh, took the advice of MH Pig Gardener. Ordered it off their website. You can see I, what I've got. I actually got two one pound packets of the 41838 and two one pound packets of the calcium nitrate. So I've got four pounds of fertilizer. Actually this is, uh, I think it was only four dollars and something for each pound of this for 1838 and it was like $2 and something for each pound of calcium nitrate but you have to have uh, the same amount of each you've got to you know it's, it would be ridiculous to order you know offset increments so because you're actually what the instruction said was to um, for five gallons which you know I may you can just use this one as I'm, as I'm mixing uh, for my reservoir um, mixing bucket but you add 12 grams of the 41838 per five gallons 12 grams of the calcium nitrate per five gallons and six grams of epsom salt uh, to make your mix so um just going to give you a shot of these buckets let you see what they look like um like i said they're free from the bakery <laughs> you have to clean them out i actually did have one girl call and tell me that she was going to clean them out two buckets i think she had but it started to snow and i just decided not to go that day and i think they got rid of them so i think one of them here i'm actually did wash out when i first got it then they've got a nice rubber like an o-ring seal around the lid which is really nice and um i did wash this one out and it still smells like cake icing so i think i'm gonna let them sit for a little bit with the uh water in them uh so uh, just going to give you a shot of this and let you see what you can do. I mean, like, you know, you go to Lowe's and buy a five-gallon bucket. It's $2 or something by the time. I mean, that adds up quick. So this is awesome because it's free. All these buckets I got for free. And uh, it's part one of it, I guess. You know, like I said, cleaning them out and getting going from there. So uh, I'll show you the next video when I'm ready to start building these buckets let you know how it goes.